Hello, this is Greg from SharePoint Maven, and in today's video, I will show you two ways how you can easily embed a plan for, from Planner into Microsoft Loop page. Uh, I love this functionality. I think it definitely will improve your productivity. So let me show you the trick. Actually, a, a total of two tricks. Um, so here, what I have, what you see right now on the screen is kind of just a loop page where I'm an onboarding an employee and a bunch of, you know, different, you know, text and, you know, uh, other loop uh, components are related uh, to um, this particular mini project. But you know what? I also maintain this task list. Essentially, I have a, you know, a plan and planner where I manage tasks, you know, for onboarding related to this employee. So uh, because I want everything in kind of one place, you know, uh, I want to embed that plan from Planner in here on the loop page. Let me show you a few ways to do so. So option number one, you actually just grab the uh, link, the URL to that plan, and you do it from Planner. So make sure you copy it. It was copied. And then all you need to do literally is just paste it, right? So I just pressed uh, Control V, right? Pasted the link and look what it did. You see, it pretty much embedded the entire plan uh, inside. And I can now, you know, work on the tasks. I can, you know, complete uh, complete them and, you know, do whatever I typically do within um, the, uh, you know, uh, Microsoft Planner. Let me show you another option. All right, you don't even need to go to Planner, all right, to, you know, copy that link. What you can do is uh, we have, uh, believe it or not, a loop uh, component called Planner. So um, you, you will probably see it right here at the bottom. All right, so you can choose that. Or you can literally just, you know, type in, right, you know, Planner right here. And it will come up with this pop-up uh, because obviously you have lots of plans in your planner app, right? And obviously if you accessed one recently, you will find it here, but I actually pinned, I pinned the plan so it's right on top and just like that, just like that. And uh, essentially, yeah, it's uh, once again, it's uh, uh, right here within the uh, loop, um, you know, application. Uh, so just a couple of uh, important uh, kind of nuances about this. Uh, so first of all, the security of this plan is bound uh, by the security, um, you know, of what you have in here, right? You know, if, let's say your plan and planner belongs to a particular, you know, Microsoft 365 group and only, you know, certain members are part of the group. Whoever has access to this plan as a result of, um, you know, uh, your Microsoft 365 group, um, those are the only people who will have access to this, you know, plan, all right? So it doesn't really matter uh, what you have set uh, in terms of, you know, sharing for this page, right? Maybe you invited like 30 people, you know, the planner security, uh, the, this plan security is bound by that Microsoft 365 group membership. So very, very important, all right? Uh, very important. As a matter of fact, for example, yeah, right here, you see, I can see these are the three Microsoft 365 group members, uh, you know, who are part of uh, the Microsoft 365 group and obviously this plan. So even if I share this page, like with everyone, you know, it doesn't really matter. It's bound by the security of Microsoft 365 group. Uh, another thing I wanted to mention is that uh, essentially, uh, yeah, all the information lives in plan, in planner. So, and you know, whatever you do here, right, it pretty much, um, it's a, a, you know, you see it live reflecting in Planner as well. So for example, let me complete this task right here, right? I'm doing so from within Microsoft, um, you know, Loop application. If I go in here, I will probably need to refresh the screen um, and you would see this task completed as well, all right? So essentially all the information still lives in Planner uh, and uh, pretty much it's always kind of a live feed uh you know that you you just pretty much you visualize this plan uh from within microsoft loop all right i think that was kind of obvious all right so uh, a really nice trick i mean again look maybe you will be using uh you know the 
uh, built-in, you know, task list, right? Uh, Kanban, you know, board uh, for task management uh, within your loop uh, application. But if you're doing kind of, you know, more sophisticated task and project management, uh, right? You you probably want, might want to rely on Planner, and this trick will allow you to embed it inside of uh, Microsoft Loop. All right. So that's all I really wanted to show you in this video. Hopefully you learned something new. As always, happy to see you on my blog, SharePointMaven.com, and as well as my YouTube channel. Goodbye.